Taken to his Twitter account, Ryan Reynolds shared the very first image from Deadpool 2. Filming is currently underway on the sequel at Hatley Castle, a stand-in for Professor Xavier's X-Men mansion that appeared in a number of the previous X-Men movie installments, including the first Deadpool. Reynolds channeling his character Wade Wilson also shared a message along with the first look. Dropped by the X-Mansion, big effing surprise, no one's home. Mark, buyer saw the first <laughs> image from Deadpool 2. It's a huge buy for me, man. A picture's worth a thousand words, and my first two are, hell yes, this is exactly what I want to see from Deadpool 2. This is the exact vibe. This is him joking around with Colossus about the mansion, about everything that is the X-Men world and his attitude towards it. Taking a nap at this point, first of all, it confirms to the fans we are going to get him involved with the other X-Men, more so in Deadpool 2, which is something that we've been, there's been announcements about that. We've been suspecting it for a long time. Perry, you see this image. Does it get you as excited as I am? Of course it does, because it reminds me of the incredible marketing campaign that they did for the first movie, and it all started with stuff like this, with Ryan Reynolds using his Twitter following to the movie's advantage and pushing out pictures that do, they don't, spoil anything they're just fun to look at they tease a little bit of the tone and what's to come i mean everybody's still online chattering about oh how many x-men are going to be in it what exactly is the trajectory for this franchise with deadpool and everything that's happening around it so it's just fun to get an image that is fun to look at really well represents what happened in the future and what's what happened in the past and what's to come in the future and it's just it's fun to look at jeremy what you got a big part of the fun of the first Deadpool movie was the marketing campaign. I'm glad they haven't lost that. <laughs> Funny thing is it's easy to be like, oh, yeah, more X-Men. But he did say no one's home. Could be him saying no X-Men are in the movie. That's a great point. That's I, a great point. I doubt that's it because we know <laughs> Cable's in it. So I, I believe there's going to be a lot more or, or at least a, a couple more X-Men. But I think it's a fun photo. I mean, it, you know, him just lounging like, eh, it figures, you know. So, I mean, I, I really love it. I love everything about the Deadpool marketing he did in the first one. I feel like I'm going to love it uh, leading up to the second one. So Harloff, sure. you did not get as many naps as I do. Do you enjoy this picture <laughs> of somebody clearly taking a nap? Absolutely. Um, I buy it for sure, but I, I actually agree with Jeremy. I don't think it confirms that a lot of X-Men are going to be in this at all. I think that it's it's probably the opposite. I think the fact that what they did, they they played off the fact that, you know, there was no one home and that they are kind of like the redheaded stepchild of the franchise and they're going to do that again with uh, with this movie. And I think that they have a little bit more money, obviously. They're so, they, but what they did in the first one, which I loved, was they clearly, this is part of the universe. Even though they show you that he's got that Ferris Bueller thing going mm -hmm. on and he's referring to the actors' names and There'll be more of that, and there'll be more of this type of stuff, but I think that it's, it's that constant... Deadpool doesn't fit in with the X-Men. He doesn't fit in with them, but he'll go there, and he'll, he want, he, I think he kind of secretly longs for it, but he'll never really do it type thing, and this is the perfect picture for it. Uh, over under three X-Men in this movie. Including oh, Cable. over with that. You're going over. I'll, so I'll, you think uh, we're going to see... The, I'm talking about the X-Men that we've seen in movies like before. What, like who? Yeah, like, like, like your Cyclopses, your Rogues, your Professor X's, your uh, Storms. And that's maybe, maybe actually, you know what? I'll go under. I'll go under. Jeremy, you love Vegas. Uh, I, I do love <laughs> Vegas. I'll say over because uh, we know Cable's in it, and if they return, if Colossus and Negasonic Teenage that's Warhead true. come that's back, three, that's least. three. So over. All yeah. right. Well, that's that's a push. I'm, I'm definitely going over too. And this is the way that you do that kind of stuff, where it's not. Oh, here is our soul movie, and we're going to throw a whole bunch of stuff to show you how we're going to build a franchise. It's our movie, and then those things are placed in it organically, and I have faith that Deadpool 2 will do just that. I think the picture did its job because it already got us talking about Deadpool 2.